What's going on YouTube? So I'm here seeking some advice. I have this Cub Cadet and this little Husqvarna 21. This one I bought when I first started for $1,400 new. This one about $400. Uh, here, let me get in a car. I'm gonna get in a truck so you can hear me better and I can get out of the way of these cars. Be right back. Alright, so like I said, man, I pay I bought that that Cub Cadet. That was my when I bought it, that was my main mower before I had a zero turn or anything. So I paid uh, fourteen hundred dollars cash for that thing. And I had the Husqvarna push mower with it. And currently, right now. I have not used that push the Husqvarna one time not one time this year didn't need to use it and the Cub Cadet I use on one yard in a backyard because my zero turn won't fit in the back one yard a week so it makes me think kind of like if you got I don't know if anybody has watched the probably have the uh, Florida Turf Pros his most recent video talking about having too much money or whatever sitting on your trailer not being used it makes total sense and I know I don't these aren't these two mowers we're talking about are not like some big high dollars zero turns or anything like that but they're worth some money you know I, I could maybe get 800 bucks or something maybe 900 if I'm lucky for that Cub Cadet you know I want to get like my trailers packed up and I keep saying I want to get a bigger trailer my, my trailers like super packed tight 5 by 10 I'm like I want to get a bigger trailer man I don't get a bigger trailer I need a bigger trailer but then I'm thinking like I don't need a bigger trailer I want a bigger trailer and I should downsize my my equipment but I don't know because I like having both of those motors even though I don't use them and uh, I don't know what I got on my face here but whatever uh, so it's like do I do I sell the expensive you know the Cub Cadet and keep that push mower for that one backyard or do I sell the push mower and keep the Cub Cadet for that one backyard or do I keep them both and have backup mowers? You know, I'm trying to think if I sell sell them or sell one, the yellow one, Cub Cadet, it would free up a lot of space on my trailer. I could use that money to, instead of having to go into my, my money that I have now and putting a cage on my trailer, I could free up space on this trailer and I want to have a cage put on it, you know, with the lock and lid and all that for gas cans and hedge trimmers and stuff like that. And I could use the money to, from the mower to do that so that, that this mower, I mean, it's it's a nice mower. I mean, it's cheaper than a zero turn, but it's, it's still money that's just sitting there being used for one backyard, a small backyard. So it's being used for like 10 minutes a week. And I just don't know if it's worth hanging on to or not. It would definitely free up my trailer. It would keep me from having to buy a bigger trailer and I could keep my compact size that I like. I like to be small. I don't really want a huge trailer. You know, I'm in these small, like these neighborhoods, man, I like just, you know, I like being compact, efficient, tight. So, help me out. Give me your guys' thoughts on that. Catch you later.